Hi and welcome to this tutorial, where we are going to explain how to achieve perfect 180 media with Canon's dual fisheye lens, and Mystica VR. Mystica VR is a powerful tool for VR post-production that enables you to stitch footage from multiple cameras, and achieve a seamless immersive experience. In this tutorial, we will walk you through the recommended workflow to create a perfect 180 alignment with Canon's dual fisheye lens. Let's get started. Mystica VR supports RAW files, including Canon CRM. When importing your shots to Mystica VR, you can edit all embedded metadata in the RAW params panel, which is located next to camera controls. You can navigate to this panel whenever you need to make adjustments during the stitching process. Once you have imported the media, right-click on the clip stack section or scene and select Load Preset to access the list of default presets. Choose Canon RF Dual Fisheye.grp. This preset will divide your shot into two cameras, left and right eye, then apply the necessary focal length and relevant parameters, providing a solid foundation for your stitching. Now let's begin by centering the lenses. Enter the one view mode and adjust the circle mask of the camera overlay to the lens of each camera. You can make the circles larger by pressing Alt key and dragging the mouse. Adjust the other camera accordingly, and exit the one view mode. Next it's time to align the 180 stereo between the two eyes. Activate the Align Mode tool in one of the cameras. Once this tool is active, you can focus on the image itself without worrying about entering any additional parameters. Switch to the black and white anaglyph view, as it helps to better visualize the stereo effect. Zoom into the center of your image, and the farthest point will serve as your convergence point to align the two eyes. In this case we will align the two cameras at the back of the room, as there are several horizontal lines that can guide us in centering the stereo view. Use the horizontal balance tool to guide the alignment of the two lenses. To move the cameras and adjust their alignment, simply drag the mouse in the central circle of the camera, until the red and blue colors of each eye disappear. Repeat this process on the sides of the image to converge the desired area, and gradually resolve any parallax issues. Return to the center and realign the image if there is any drift. Continue this process until you have resolved any misalignment issues. For a quick check of your stereo effect, press the R and E keys to switch between the left and right eye views. We can see that vertical disparities are almost non-existent. One parameter you may want to tweak is the coaxial distance. Keep in mind that adjusting this parameter won't change the depth of your shot, but will correct the view for a certain distance from the camera. Focus on a specific point such as a table, and increase the coaxial distance until that point is vertically aligned at the most important distance for the scene. By doing so, you can enhance the stitching and improve the overall stereo effect. When performing this calibration, it is important to choose an environment where there are no objects very close to the camera. Ideally, the scene should have a distant horizon to help converge the images. Once you have achieved your desired results, you can save the preset for future shots with the same camera setup to speed up the stitching process of the next shot. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, or follow us on social media if you want to keep up with the latest news on Mystica technology. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.